Hello, this is Dr. Gay from First Sick MRI, and this is just a really quick case of a bone tumor in a patient who is 13 years old. This is a benign bone tumor and a very common one. So here we go. This is a view. The patient had just generalized knee pain, went to see the orthopedic surgeon. They're 13. They had uh, bilateral pain, but they saw something down here on the right side, and this is in the tibial metadiaphysis on the right. The lateral view showed this uh, sharply defined sclerotic margin with no bone expansion, so it looks like a benign non-aggressive process, but they wanted to look at it better, and so here we go. We see the lesion back here. It does have this sharply defined low signal margin, meaning it has bone sclerosis, minimal endosteal scalloping. Here's a PD fat set sequence. You see no perilesional edema. With contrast, there was enhancement, uh, but uh, just mild, and there was no enhancement around the periphery, so because of the uh, young age and the posterior eccentric um, location here. This is compatible with just a benign non-ossifying fibroma or fibrous cortical defect. Really, really common and with age these will spontaneously resolve but if you ever see anything that's sharply defined with lobulated margins and hugging the posterior or any uh, peripheral uh, portion but usually it's for some reason the posterior uh, cortex uh, beneath it they can have endosteal scalloping and again the main things are that sclerotic margin, young person, no bone expansion, no perilesional edema, almost for sure it's going to be a non-ossifying fibroma that will resolve with uh, age and you can just um, let them know that, yep, this is benign. If they want to do x-ray, this is overkill to watch it spontaneously resolve, they can, but really it doesn't even need any follow-up. So uh, just a basic simple case of a <clears throat> benign non-ossifying non fibroma in a 13-year-old.